Hello everyone, my name is Itas Patel and you are watching Itas Patel official YouTube channel. Welcome to the part 34 of responsive e-learning website development in PHP with PDO. So guys, in last tutorial, we successfully see that how can we get this one. So in this tutorial, we are going to be working on these uh, borders which is coming from here. And we'll make uh, this uh, footer back uh, bottom and this uh, sharing button. So without wasting of time, let's get start. So first of all, let's see one more thing here. It doesn't change the image uh, color here, so right? So now let's uh, see what we have wrong here. So you can see that here it doesn't add any dashes from here, and always we get it started from dashes. Okay. Now let's refresh so you can see that now the color are changes perfectly. Okay. You can see that perfectly, and. You have to set here the perfect color which has FFF. So when someone write something from here, so it color will be white. You can see that. You can see that. Okay. And the same way we can set from here color has FFF. Okay. So refresh that one. You can see that also here. Perfect. Perfect. All are perfect. Okay, so now the first task is we need to set here a border. So how can we set that a border from there? So come back into the footer.php and here use the one span tag. Span tag open and end that span tag after three character of about us. Okay, so now come back here and inside that footer we said footer u l l i h to have some span tag so border bottom one pixel solid has this color which is our twitter color okay now let's refresh and check you can see that the border is coming perfectly as the same way what we are going to do here on contact cast we set the span tag here cut that span tag and after three character we paste that one as the same way we are going to use here we use a span tag span tag close cut that span tag and paste it from here okay so now let's see so you can see that the border is coming perfectly you can see that the border is coming perfectly well, we need the one one changes from here. Okay. Also, we need to set the two pixel of border and let's see how it's look like. Now it's looking very good and very perfect. But you can see that this is joining with the words. So how can we give the space? So the simple way is to giving the space is padding from bottom five percent and its box sizing will be the border box. Let's refresh it so you can see that I think 5% is too much. So we need to change it with the 4%. Refresh that one so you can see that. Let's see this one. Okay, so I think this is a 2% of uh, padding from the bottom. Let's see and refresh this one so you can see that now it's looking very good and perfect. You know, very perfect. Okay, and the same we have here. Okay, so the our next task is we need to add this uh, sharing buttons from here so how can you do that so simply i'm going to again footer.php and after this uh, table i'm creating one view with the id equal to f share which means footer sharing buttons okay so here we are going to again create one view with the id equal to <laughs> with the id equal to 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 with the id equal to fd okay and here we are going to create one a tag with the href has for now and we set a one icon from here of facebook so how can you do that simply 
paste that one from here change this one with the facebook okay let's see the output let's see the output so you can see that the facebook is not coming just because we make a mistake some here so we are again going to the font awesome website going to the font awesome icons And here we find out the oh so, 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 sorry 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 Facebook so we need this one so we can copy this one how can we do that simply come back here copy this one paste that icon from here so now let's check what we have here refresh it so you can see that the Facebook is coming perfectly so as the same way we are going to copy this one from here by control c and control v and this one is for the let's see google plus yeah so we can set with the gp and here we said uh, google plus let's see the output refresh it so you can see that Google Plus is also coming from here. So let's see, uh, find out again. Google. Yeah, we need this one. Uh, let's see what we have here. Okay, GP, G Plus. Okay, so we are here. Copy this one. Paste that one from here. And now what we are going to do again, we are going to copy this one from here, paste it, and we said TW, which means Twitter. Let's see with the Twitter. Let's refresh and check. So you can see that a Twitter is also coming from here. Now, what we are going to do here just simply we are come back again from here and we said the f share we are targeting this id which is coming from here we are targeting this id from here so we said the width will be 100 percent and then let's now target f share have some new then it's uh, width will be 60 pixel and its uh, height will be 60 pixel so let's see refresh it so you can see that and its line height also 60 pixel let's refresh so you can see that and now we set one more thing from here float left refresh that one so you can see that and one more thing we are going to do here is border radius 100% okay so now we set for the example purpose we set here a one background with a 000 let's refresh it so you can see that you can perfectly see that and we need to also one more thing from here text align center okay let's see okay so you can see that and we also set one more thing margin from the top zero percent from the right one percent from the bottom zero percent from the left one percent okay let's see so you can see that perfectly perfect output but is a too much height so we can set it with the 40 pixel and here is also we can set it with the 40 pixel refresh that one okay okay i think 40 pixel is too oh yeah, yeah yeah here 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 from here we can set also 40 pixel press it so this one is perfect now the next task is uh f share have a deal when someone hover on it so it's border radius zero pixel okay so let's see what happened when someone hover on it so you can see that that is rounded with the circle uh, 
circle to square okay but we need to one more thing here so let's copy this one from here by control c paste that one from here by control v a take and we set the hmm, what we are going to setting here yeah text decoration will be none and its color will be has ff which means white color okay let's refresh and check so you can see that the perfect output the perfect output but you can see here this is the colors okay so we need to find out the hex color of that one so how can you do that so simply we are going to google uh if you observe here we give the id here so we already have a twitter background so we can set it from here so let's set that one has tw background has mm, there is a background that yeah here it is so we are going to paste that background from here so now let's uh, refresh it and let's uh, remove this background from here let's remove this background and refresh it so you can see that the twitter background is coming from here but we need the gp and uh, fb background so how can you do that so simply uh, let's first of all copy from here paste that one again and again we use here fb and we use here gp okay so now only we need to find out the colors so we are going to go uh, we are going google and we said facebook hex color code so here is the facebook hex color code you can see that copy that one from here paste that one from here as the same way we are finding out the google plus hex code color yeah here it is so you can see that here also that color is coming from here so copy that one from here and paste that color from here now let's check out with the output refresh it so you can see that the perfect color are coming from here but you can see here this is a very cool effect very cool effect you can see that very cool effect and when someone hover on that view then also change the background with the has we do it do let's see when someone hover on it that's it should be a yes we have this one but we need to give them a transition here so we can set the transition transition all 0.3s okay let's see now it's working very well or not so you can see that the transition is working very well but it, it it's again not uh, moving like this one you can see that this is a very smooth effect very smooth effect and look at this one Hover when we are hover on it that it's it is working fine but when we are hover out that time is not working very well so how can we do that so simply come back again here and set the is in dash out property let's see the output now you can see that now it's looking very good and perfect one more thing we are going to change it here we set the display block display block okay let's refresh it and check it again you can see that nice looking very good and very perfect effect perfect effect but we need to remove some margin from here let's see the button button where is the button yeah here it is the button not like this one the button is here is the button 
margin from top okay so let's uh, do it with uh, margin top minus 5% let's refresh and check i think this is this is uh, perfect yeah perfect yeah we doesn't need any margin from here i think this one is perfect yes this is very perfect oh yeah, yeah, yeah. not this one this one this one we uh, we need this one control z edit refresh it so you can see that now nice looking very good perfect way perfect very 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 well very well the next task is we need to set the footer h2 here after this uh, ul we are going to create a one h3 tag from here and we set the same line as we have here you can see that copy this one paste that one from here and let's check the output refresh it so you can see that the output is coming from here before the output okay 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 okay, okay, okay. let's come back here and set here has footer have some h3 then it's background will be has twee 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 and then its color will be has fff and its uh, height will be 40 pixel and its uh, line height will be 40 pixel and then its uh, text align will be center let's refresh and check so you can see that the output of this one but i think we need to set this one, we need to remove this one from here and set it on our li, uh, ul okay let's refresh and check so you can see that the output is now completely perfectly coming perfectly coming you can see that but we need to increase more so how can you do that so simply set with the 50 pixel here is also 50 pixel let's refresh you can see that as we have here as the same thing we have here but we need to uh font weight we need to remove the font hold it to normal normal let's refresh so you can see that now it's looking very good and very perfect very perfect so guys i think this is enough for today in next tutorial we are going to working on this uh, <laughs> where we are going to working now we will working on this one yeah we are working on here when someone hover on it so it will be display a categories and subcategories from here so we will uh, in next tutorial we are working on this one so guys i think this is enough for today if you guys are like my videos and like and share my videos and if you have any question in your mind then comment below and don't forget to subscribe to the channel we will meet you in next tutorial so stay connected with me stay tuned thanks for watching guys goodbye